Daddy, what are we gonna do right now? We are going back to school shopping. I think back to school shopping is stressful. Like, I'm very stressed out right now. <laughs> Wait a minute, Maya. Do you even need a first day of school outfit? Not really. Hello, everyone. Thank you for joining us today. I cannot believe I'm saying this right now, but we are already getting ready to go back to school. How did summer fly by so quickly? Addie, what grade are you going to be in this year? Seventh. Seventh grade. How is that possible? Hmm. <laughs> Maya, what grade are you going to be in? Fifth grade. Fifth. Colin is going to be in first grade this year and then our foster daughter is in seventh grade just like Addie. And believe it or not, those two have already started school. So they're not here, they are at their first full day of school right now. And Maya, you've actually got some really big news this year. Yes, I am going to an actual school. No more homeschool. That's right, we have been doing homeschool in this room actually for the last four years, I think. And so this year, believe it or not, we have four kids going to four different schools. Just gonna be Addie and I homeschooling in here, but she does go to a tutorial. Um, Addie, wanna explain what a tutorial is? It's like where you go to school some days of the week and you homeschool the rest. So we go to school Tuesday and Thursdays and we homeschool Monday, Wednesday, Friday. That's right. And then Maya, Colin, and our foster daughter are going to three different schools. So. We're gonna have a lot of driving in the mornings between Jason and I, making sure we get all the kids to the right schools and then a lot of driving in the afternoons, getting them all back home. Addie, what are we gonna do right now? We are going back to school shopping. That's right. Addie has a pretty decent size back to school shopping list that she needs to buy for school. At Maya school, they actually provide all the materials, so she is not shopping today, which is kind of sad because I love back to school shopping. Okay, so so far I still need notebook paper, um, one pocket folder, I have that at home, a water bottle, I have that, um, paper towel rolls, plastic forks, a dry eraser, antibacterial disinfectant wipes, 12 pack <laughs> colored pencils, a composition book or spiral notebook for journaling, and that's it. Apparently they have scented glue sticks now, which kind of seems like a terrible idea because we have enough problem with kids eating glue. This is a pencil pouch, it's so cute. That is so cute. I love it. I'm kind of wishing I was school supply shopping. There are so many cute things. I want to be a little kid buying school supplies. There's just too many fun things. I'm glancing down in the cart at Addie's school supplies and they had the cutest, most fun, colorful composition books and let me show you the one she picks out. That one. Why so boring? Black and white? It's plain and if my interests change throughout the year then I don't have to deal with like an old thing. So that's what I like about plain colors. We are gonna pause our back to school shopping now because we have a major Super exciting announcement for you. Do you remember a movie where you were filming about two years ago? It's called Camp Hideout. Do you remember that? It was with Christopher Lloyd and Corbin Blue, Amanda Layton, all of these incredible people. Well, it's coming to theaters on September 15th. We are so excited. It is a faith-based film made by a small independent company. So we would love you guys to go out the opening weekend and support it mm -hmm. September 15th. I think we have a little clip for you right now. So, here's the hopper where the ammo goes. Paintballs come out of here. <gasps> pew, pew! <laughs> You're gonna line these little bits up to aim, okay? And then the safety is right. Where did you guys learn how to do that? YouTube. Becky! Becky! <sighs> oh. Wait. Wait for us. Hey, look, guys, I'd love for you to join, but we really need even teams for Capture the Flag. Hey, guys. Game on! They're on our team. Addie and I had the best time filming on set. Mm-hmm. 
and we're actually having some behind the scenes vlogs coming out soon and it shows you what it's like to film a movie and behind the scenes so I definitely watch for those. Plus if you hang until the end of this video you can see the official trailer for Camp Hideout. Woohoo! Are you looking at a gray sweatshirt, Addy? <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna use some color. Hey, and I do need colored. Oh look, it's like a special different fabric thing Ooh. for the hoodie. We have a tradition every year. We take the kids to the mall and they get to pick out a first day of school outfit because it's kind of fun to just show up for your first day of school wearing something you really feel good in. Arizona! Oh yeah! You gotta represent where we're from, right? Yes. So Maya's picked out her First day of school outfit. We've got flare jeans. Boom. Probably not gonna wear the Crocs with them. Yeah, no. The Crocs are cool. Like maybe boots or. I don't know. And we got your Arizona shirt. Oh, yeah. But wait a minute, Maya. Do you even need a first day of school outfit? Not really. Why don't you need a first day of school outfit? Because I have uniforms. So Maya's gonna be sporting a uniform this year, but she didn't want to miss out on the back to school shopping, so she's getting a maybe a first day of the weekend outfit. I don't know. Arizona. You found another Arizona shirt, your birthplace. <laughs> well, I think back to school shopping is stressful. Like I'm very stressed out right now. <laughs> oh, it's supposed to be fun. I know, but it's like, there's so many outfits and stores and everything and I don't know, I just can't do it. I think Addie would live in her baggy sweatshirts and baggy shirts and shorts. You can find something, Addie, you can find something. <laughs> Don't I have plenty of t-shirts at home? I can put under this. You look cozy. You know, it feels kind of cozy. You look at you look cozy and cute. Thank you. I feel like a five-year-old whose mom is playing dress up with them. <laughs> oh, Addie. <laughs> it's cute. I like nice. it. I keep throwing more outfits over the door to her dress room and I don't know if she's appreciating my taste. Yeah, Addy, you should try this on. I bet you'd love it. He doesn't like it. <laughs> I like the top. Thank you. All right. I like this too. Can we at least get a top? Yeah. If we can't find a bottom. Yeah. I like this, this, and this. All tops. <laughs> So we could just wear gym shorts. Yeah. <laughs> well, we did it, kind of. Maya's got a back school outfit, even yes. though she doesn't really need one. Mm -hmm. And Addie's got half of a back school outfit. Yep. Better than nothing, right? I feel accomplished. Another one of our favorite back to school traditions is getting a back to school haircuts, just to kind of freshen things up before the new school year begins. Addie, what's your plan for your hair today? I'm gonna get it cut back to shoulder length because I had it there originally, but then it grew out some, and my current bangs have gotten longer, so I'm gonna cut this back to jaw length. What are you doing with your hair today? Um, I'm getting it trimmed and curtain bangs. You're getting curtain bangs. Exciting. I don't think the girls are doing anything too drastic today. I remember so vividly when I was younger, my sister and I went together to the hair salon and probably got like 10 inches cut off our hair. It was a big change. And then we came home and just bawled and cried because we missed our hair. Luckily, our mom consoled us and reminded us that hair always grows back. So we got over it. <laughs> Let's see, Maya. Ooh, I love it. Those cute little <laughs> curtain bangs. Yes. Makes you look older. You ready for fifth grade now? Yes. Officially? Yes. <laughs> There's so much hair on the floor. I think Addie got a lot cut off. <laughs> I think she got about four inches. Yeah. That's a good amount. Is done. Oh, I love it. Thank you. Cute length. Thank you. And cute curtain bangs. I've got two curtain bang girls now. Mm -hmm. So fun. 
we're back home and the girls are getting on their first day of school outfits. That means Maya's getting on her brand new uniform to show you their full back to school look with hair and clothes. And I just can't believe it is back to school time. I love summer, I love having all the kids home, but I'm also excited to get back to a good routine and a schedule and um, so I guess it's here whether I'm ready for it or not. This year we have so many big changes happening with back to school. Colin has started his big boy school, as we call it, and he's been doing great so far. And the biggest change is Maya. We've been homeschooling for four years and her going back to a traditional school is just bittersweet for me because I'm gonna miss having her around and that special time we have at home together. But I'm also super excited for her big adventure. and. Going back to school, she gets a locker this year. She's gonna make some new friends and I think it'll be a sweet year for her and for all the kids really. And who knows where we'll be next year. We kind of reevaluate every year and we're just gonna take the time and enjoy this year. Enjoy first grade and fifth grade and seventh grade. Maya, I love it. Do a spin for us. Ooh, how does it feel to wear a uniform? Good. Do you think it's gonna make the mornings a little bit easier? Yes. You won't have any choices. You just pull your uniform on. Yeah. And yeah, it looks great on you, girly. I'm excited you. for you. All right, you've seen Maya's first day of school outfit, her uniform, which will not just be her first day of school outfit, it'll pretty much be her every day of school outfit. Now let's check out Addie's. Ooh, I love it, girly. Thank Give you. us a spin too. Ooh, very cute. Thank you. Are you ready for seventh grade? Yes. What are you most excited about for seventh grade? I don't really know. I have a bunch of books that I want to read in seventh grade, and I'm also excited to get back into the routine of the school year, so. We hope you guys have an awesome start of the school year too, whether you are starting today, whether you started a couple weeks ago, or maybe you're not even starting for another month. We hope it is a wonderful start to the school year. But right now is the moment you've all been waiting for. We are so excited to show you this. Here's the trailer for Camp Hideout. Are you ready for the best week of your life? Whoa! That was everybody's first full day of camp. This whole thing isn't really my scene. I'm Becky with a B. I'm Noah with a no. Oh, <laughs> okay. You are in with the aardvarks. We used to have a bit of a bladder control problem. Anyway. A child prodigy who was described by his computer teacher as potentially problematic. <sighs> I'm Mallory, since you asked. Somebody's got a crush. <laughs> I do not have a crush. He's had a lot to overcome in his life. Stop that kid! A little punk! You know what the judge said after your last request. Last chance, blah, 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 whatever. That juvenile delinquent has been nothing but trouble since he got here. The dust up at the climbing wall. Knock it off. Sneaking in comes the bed. You stole a magical video game from a bunch of gangsters. We're going to that camp, and we're going to get what's ours. When I get my hands on that kid. You don't think some people are beyond help? What are you guys doing here? We're all here for you. When we Does everyone remember what to do? And if you trust, and rely on your friends. You might just find it'll change your whole life. Hey, turkeys, I'm up here. We all followed our own path to arrive here in this moment. Think about all of the lives that have turned around here. You've been given a great opportunity that people will care about you. I got him, Charlie! Be sure to watch it in theaters on September 15th. We'd love to see you guys there on opening weekend. It's gonna be awesome. XOXO! Bye!